best. I don't know that there are words to adequately express how truly sorry we are. The worst has happened. No use crying over spilled food now. Here, this always cheered me up when I was younger. <gasps> My spicy flat noodle soup. Oh my, this is truly delightful. Mm, this is the best thing you've made so far. And I thought the food before was the best. That's all I've ever wanted to do, Father. Make food for the ponies of Canterlot, like the food we made together when I was younger. It has been so long since we cooked together. <laughs> Remember how you used to hide the ingredients you did not like? <laughs> <laughs> no, what? Who cares what some stuffy unicorn thinks of the food here? It's exquisite. That's true. And you don't need three silly hooves in your window to prove it. That's double true. You just need ponies in here to give it a chance. Ponies that will tell every pony else in Cantalot that the Tasty Treat is the best food in the city. That's true times three. But without Zesty's approval, no pony will even try our food. Oh, yes, they will. Pinky, we are the perfect team for this. We were just doing the wrong jobs. I will go out and bring the crowd. You stay here and make sure this place is every bit as unique and rustic as it was the moment we walked in. And what about us? You two? You are going to cook. Make whatever you want and make a lot of it. I intend to bring a crowd. Would the owner of one of the premier boutiques in Cantalot put a stamp of approval on something that wasn't fabulous? Open. My father and I just wanted to say thank you for all of your help. We've both been so stressed about the restaurant succeeding that we forgot what it was we loved about it in the first place. Cooking is something we used to love to do together. No matter what happens next, thank you for reminding us of that. Oh, you guys! Group hug! <laughs> <laughs> now come on! We've got a party to throw! <laughs> Welcome to the Tasty Treat! Make yourselves comfortable! Please, feel free to sample the food! What's this? What is every pony doing here? This place has no hooves! It is not in keeping with the level of cuisine that I have set for Cantalot. No pony told you this place was acceptable. Uh, Rarity and her friend said it was good? They told us. They told you? And who are they to tell you anything? Rarity can tell you what hats to wear with which skirts. Her friend can tell you how to maintain a tragic look for a frizzy mane. They can't tell you what food you can eat. No, we can't. And neither can you. No pony has the right to tell these ponies what to think. Zesty, you have very specific and very strange. You said very strange opinions about food. And that's your right. But just because you like your food a certain way, there is no reason to tell these ponies that they need to do the same. Rarity is right. I, for one, think the food here is delicious. I own the smoked oat on Restaurant Row. I hate the food we make. From now on, it's all smoked, basted, and grilled. This food is an inspiration. I own the bake stop. I'm going to bake my mother's bud cake the way she made it, full of flavor. <laughs> Zesty, are you sure you wouldn't like to try the food? Ignoring a unique and fresh establishment such as this could do serious damage to your social standing. <laughs> Are both truly amazing. 